There will be times for a hotel, either during the year or even on certain days of the week, where demand peaks. There is very high demand and very few rooms to meet this demand. Now, how does a hotel manage this demand and make sure that they tap into it in the most profitable way? Or they ensure that the forecasted high demand can be reduced to match the rooms that the hotel has to sell. Well, setting over booking limits at a room type level could be one way of directing demand to the desired inventory. Other ways of managing this very high demand can be more financial in nature, such as reducing discounted rates and increasing general room rates. There are also some legal tactics that can be employed during peak seasons, such as altering terms and conditions to make cancellation policies tighter and requiring payment to guarantee bookings. But there's also one more inventory management tool that is often employed to manage high demand. This tool is referred to as an availability control. Essentially, what this involves is the setting of restrictive conditions to accept booking on high demand days. The objective is to avoid the piling up of reservation inquiries that are only asking for the excess demand days and to leave space for need periods. The restrictions are then adjusted as often as required depending upon the pickup. Restrictions are set based on forecasted demand as far out as possible, taking into consideration the lead time, i.e. how many days are left prior to arrival, and the average length of stay at the hotel. Now, based on these two parameters, the revenue manager identifies which days should be restricted and which ones need a push. Afterwards, he or she will choose the best type of availability control, set it up, and monitor the pickup. Controls will be set, monitored, adjusted, and eventually lifted. It's a dynamic process replicated in all distribution channels simultaneously.